A design expert, Hamish, joins us on to and now to review one of his favourite inspirational interior design books. Good morning, Hamish. Good morning. I love it when you go to the library and bring books in for us. No, this one, this one's mine because I can actually find this copy of it and I use it all the time. It's quite a new book, and as you can see, it's very well thumbed and read. Who's Vicente? Vicente Wolf. Okay, he is a, an interior designer and photographer based in New York. Now, once a year, he pops off, as I'm sure we'd all love to, to go to places like um, the markets in Cairo, oh, or nice. Nairobi. Yeah. I know, one of those lifestyles, mm -hmm. clearly. And, for inspiration. Uh, for, for inspiration. <laughs> nice. And you can see that in the book. Now, the reason I've chosen this book is a lot of the stuff that's in here is actually a usable sort of interior. So, and you know how. Is that why you admire him? Because it is usual? I, admire, I, I do, because when I look at the pictures in the book, I see a place that I feel I could actually walk into and sit down and not worry about where do I, well, I was going to say, where do I put my man bag? <laughs> well, you can't perhaps. I don't know, Mel, where Mel would put her handbag. Uh, <laughs> hang on, man. Terrible. Okay. Show us, these are some of your favourite ones we've got here. Yeah, we've got yourself. some images up. So you can see he has stuff. And funnily enough, um, we as human beings, we have stuff ourselves, yes. mm. don't we? We Lots have knickknacks, treasures we collect. He has um, a different weight, leaning mirrors up. Everything's very clean looking, but still usable. Right. And you see you've got some extra chairs, push them against the wall and lean smart against them. I like the leaning, but he doesn't have kids, obviously. No, no, he doesn't have children. Right. Christ, of of yeah. course not. Yes, we can't have nailed every, down. It's not always perfect. <laughs> um, there's a nice grouping of artworks. He's, once again, it's not all hung on the wall. It's on some floating shelves and stacked in there. Right. What I do like is from the book and his work, there is stuff that you can do at home. So you can have a corner and you can copy what he's done with his layouts in the book. Because a lot of the time we look at things that have got built-in furniture or it's on a super yacht and we go, look at that $20,000 chandelier. I can't buy anything that's cheap that looks like that. Yeah. So I, I like the, the realness of what he does. Is it more about looking at the pictures that he's got in the book or is it more about understanding his approach to design, do you think? Well, I think it's understanding his approach to design. Right. I think the book is the kind of book that anyone can look at. Mm -hmm. So you could tuck your man bag under that, no problem. <laughs> Out outstanding. <laughs> Wouldn't even I can see my up. keys in a little bowl there. There's a shower <laughs> with a lot of knobs on it. I don't think I'd handle that shower. It'd be far too confusing. Far yeah. too confusing mm. for me. But anyway, inside the book, I'm going to show you some pictures. Okay, good. Okay, allow me to pop nice. through to post it number one. <laughs> yeah. It's so right. Organized. This is something that he does a lot of. Now I've got to hold it up straight. See this rail that runs along the wall. Yes. It's about 1.6 off the ground. Right. It's about 150 centimetres out and it's a floating shelf, but they run in big long lengths. Okay? I like that. So then you can lean your artwork on it, you can put your treasure next to it. If you're talented, you can pick some flowers and put it in there as well. Nice, no, really helps break okay. out the wall, doesn't it? Maybe it does. one more show quickly. Uh, one more right, I've got time for one more. Okay. You have. Oh, really? I better be quick. No pressure. Nice. Make it no great. pressure. Oh, okay, well, he also uses colour. Ooh, for lovely. his inspiration. So I thought I would show you this. There's the photo we took of something he saw in his travels, and there is how he's brought it into his design. Oh, I love it. Colour can be on cushions. Hamish, that is awesome. Yep, thank you no, so much. Thank for you that. so much. I love that.